your driving, your relationships. Gaining that kind of attitude from inside out will make you live life in a healthier, happier way. So we're trying to say we might be in a position to handle some of this overload, not just the overload of end of semester, graduation, starting an adult life, but the nature of being swamped by media, being sort of overwhelmed by things coming at us uh, from every direction. And some we can push away, some we can't, some gets in subliminally, and it's in our subconscious. Just being frazzled, anxious, and worried at times, or having the blues, or having bad dreams, or being shaky, having low self-esteem, not having the, the bravery to be a, a real adventurer in, in the journey of life. So we're really trying to come and help you feel um, more refreshed and uh, more relaxed after this hour or so is done. So our goal is to invite you into an experience that you have to come with your heart and head and, and give, it, give it a try. We're making it easy for you because we're going to do small group breakouts after about a 20, 25 minute warm up. Period. And Eric is going to introduce our two monks and, and they're called in there and they're uh, tradition Dadachi. I'm a practitioner of yoga. And these two monks here are members of the same yoga group that I work with long with. And one dad is from Africa, the other dad is from India. <coughs> and they dedicate their whole life to uh, serving humanity and to uh, what they call self realization through yoga. Yoga literally means union, union with spirit or God way you want to call it, and it's a process of working through many things in your life and developing the qualities and whatnot to arrive in that condition. And um, so they're here, basically, a lot of the work in this country deals a lot with uh, teaching about meditation and uh, yoga postures because it does relieve stress and gives you more mental clarity to deal with um, the daily life and different circumstances that come. So I guess from there we can start with the song. <clears throat> Actually, this is the way we we greet. Um, it is a simple gesture, and it has a very profound meaning. It means I that I greet you, not that being that you are, but the image of God in you. sincerity of my mind and the cordiality of my heart. You know, that simple gesture, uh, if you take it inward, it means something very big. You know, it doesn't matter what the person has done to you, but you don't see that actual person in front of you. You see something greater than that entity in front of you, and that's what you with, with sincerity, you know. So you might see people doing this in the, in the TV or somewhere. Mostly in India, just when people greet, you know, and that's what it simply means. Okay. So <laughs> thank you all for making the time to be here, and uh, we enjoy your company and. It's very relaxing and entertaining, you know. So it's not you're yeah, not like your teacher who has a red pen, okay? <laughs> you thought I'd be dancing too, but I'm not gonna hold that. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 that's okay. <laughs> so I'm gonna play a very soft music, very soothing music, you know, to prepare your mind to that gentle and soft. Uh, time that we're going to have
It is a devotional song that has something to do with human and their relation to God. That will be the first part, and the second part will be what we call Kritan. Kritan is a chanting word that is in Sanskrit, that means what matters most in the world, what matters most is love for God. What the second part of the song I'm going to sing means. I believe you guys are getting my accent. <laughs> it's okay? <laughs> All right. <laughs> you know, the first time I gave a lecture in uh, California, it was in a prison, you know. I can, the accent from Africa was stronger than this, okay? It was very strong. So after the lecture, a guy stood up, you know, started to hold over. What, what language this guy is speaking at all? <laughs> you know, I guess while he was speaking English, you know, so I think now the accent is getting better. So I, I, I hope you guys will get it. Thank you. 